Central America.
Hi, everybody. Good evening. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hola. Hello, deme un segundito que no, casi no ah, escucho. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Ah, Can you hear me a little better now? Me logran escuchar. Can you can you hear me, guys? Yes, yes, me escucho. Okay, okay. Good yeah, evening. I can. Hi, good evening. So, hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening. Happy to see you. Happy Wednesday. How are you? How are you doing? So, oh, I'm happy to see some of you already. Hi, Moses. How you doing, <laughs> Richard? Brenda, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo está, Miss? ¿Cómo siguió? A teacher, pues, ahí, más o menos. Uh, ya que, sí. Ya quería mejorar un poquito. Sí, le escucho la voz todavía un poquito, like, ah, fuerte sí, por ahí. Estoy desarrollando. <ríe> en proceso. En proceso. Estoy saliendo barba. Para ir really hot, pero espero que, que you know, prontito ya está súper, súper bien. Para mi clave. You know, God willing, you will be fine. So, what about the rest, guys? ¿Cómo les ha ido? How is your Wednesday going? ¿Todo bien? ¿Everything good? I see Guadalupe, Norbert. Eh... Beautiful. Ah, no, bad teacher. Bad. Why? Yes, injection. Serena. Why? COVID. Injection COVID. Oh, ahora se la pusieron. You got it today. Yes. Oh, uh, you're the lucky two, one. Two doses. <laughs> Oh, the second one, ok. The Pero no one. solo es por ir al estadio, right? <laughs> ah, no, 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 es por, es por cuidar a, la de, a los clientes. Ah, ok, ok. Ah, so it was, no. it was necessary. Cuando se, eh, cuando se puede, se va al estadio. I mean, yeah, because of the policies. Cuando, yeah. mm -hmm. I heard that some uh, did it, you know, some uh, se pusieron la dosis solo por eso, just because of that. Hay, hay, hay prioridades más importantes. Mm, okay, nice, nice. Glad to hear that. Guys, todos tienen la vacuna. Everybody got like the COVID dose. No. I only have uh, one dosis. You got the first. So le yes. falta la segunda. You were missing yes. the second one. Okay, no side effects. No tuvieron efectos secundarios, no side effects. No, very nice, my no, teacher. Yeah, yeah. Good. No pega ya. Yes, a little. Tomamos agua de chorro, agua de pozo, ya. No okay. okay, okay. Moses, did you get it? Did you get the vaccine? Vaccine en la significa vacuna, ¿va? Mm -hmm. Yes, the Yo vaccine. Me confundí, me, me confundí, eso iba a decir. No lo dije porque tenía duda. Oh, that, that's a vaccine. Uh -huh. Yeah, well, espero que igual si ya les pusieron o se están esperando a su, a su grupo etario, <ríe> su grupo de edad, you know. Eh, Yo no, me adelanté, no. dice, me adelanté. <ríe> yeah, so me too, me tocaba en el de los 15, but anyways. Sí, um, sí pero tocó, fue el work. work. Yeah, but I really hope, you know, you're fine, que no tengan ningún efecto secundario and that you're, you know, just uh, ready for that. So guys, uh, today we got session number 13. Tenemos la sección número 13. Uh, pretty much esta semana ya se fue. Terminamos la próxima, you know, unbelievable. Pero el tiempo sí se va volando. So time is flying like crazy. <laughs> and ya casi terminan módulo básico and everything. Um, I think that you're doing just a good job. And uh, in the morning, I felt like uh, compartirles la, la picture because I think it's very important. Eh, de vez en cuando, you know, recordar why am I studying English? Why am I taking this sacrifice? So la, la frasecita like I shared today was when you want to give up, remember what you started. So guys, siempre que tengan like, ay, no me quiero conectar. <laughs> Okay, or, ay, quiero apagar la cámara, you know. So remember, okay, para que me va a servir inglés. 
So why? ¿Por qué decidí empezar esto? Five months ago, right? Four months ago. And, uh, ¿Y cómo lo voy a ocupar? So how am I going to use English? Um, he visto el progreso. De hecho, today morning, por alguna razón, estaba viendo el módulo 1. No sé si se recuerdan. But I was checking like module number one. Uh, ¿Cómo el grupo comenzó? How the group has been like, ¿cómo ha avanzado? ¿Cómo ha progresado? And I'm super excited. Um, so les recomiendo que si tienen, you know, the chance, vayan al módulo 1, vean las grabaciones, vean like el progreso que han tenido. Um, ¿Qué tan? Ahora es un poco más fácil comunicarse. Probably el listening ha mejorado, you know. So you listen to your classmates, entienden más rápido. Um, ya no necesito leer hello my name is I know how to say it and, and so it is bien importante recordar estos pequeños logros right eh, que vamos eh, desarrollando every single day la clase de ahora I think is very interesting vamos a hablar un poquito de cómo reportarnos al trabajo eh, how to tell your boss hey boss no voy a ir a trabajar me siento mal and we are also going to be talking about eh, un par de enfermedades some suggestions and things like those. Um, so, to get started, eh, si me ayudan con su camarita un par de minutos, that would be amazing. Voy a tomarles la asistencia. Let me go ahead and take your attendance. So, hold on, hold on. Let me just go here. So, my first person is Anita. Creo que había in the, Anita por ahí. <laughs> Hi, Anita. How are you? Uy, what did I do? Uh, Brenda, well, Brenda, she was there too. Brian, Present. creo que Brian Present. se está conectando. Thank you so much. Present. Thank you, Brian. How are you? I'm fine. Good, 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 good. Carlos, Carlos, Present. Carlos. Hey, Carlos, thank you. And, do, do, do. Guadalupe. Teacher. Hola, Norbert. It's a myth. I'm uh, sorry? It is a raining. Ah. In Okay, por eso se escucha. No worries, ahorita le tomo asistencia just in case. Eh, Jackie. Gracias, Miss. Jackie, todavía no. So Jackie's not here. Uh, Ignacio. Hi, Ignacio. Good evening. Acabo de ver a Ignacio. Oh, I think he stood up. Um, Jocelyn. <coughs> Oh, she is coming. Okay. Uh, hi, Ignacio. Solo me regala confirmación, please. Yeah, present, teacher. Uh, oh, present. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, Pedrino, no worries. So, thank you. Gracias por comentármelo, too. Um, got Ignacio. Norbert. Well, Norbert, ya lo escuché. I heard you already. Thank you so much. Mr. Bonillo. Todavía no. Eh, López, Marvin López. Okay, Clary, Clary Vélez está por acá. Hello, Miss. Hey. How are you doing? I'm doing bien. fine. Se escucha un poquito, está lloviendo, ¿verdad? Sí, yes, it's raining hard over here. Creo que Meli va a tener problemas con su inter también. Oh, that's why. Creo que donde yes. Anita también, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher, pero no. Ajá, sí, se, se logra escuchar un poco más. Se escucha claro. bien. Ah, okay. Uh, no, but yeah, I mean, I can hear you. Sí se escucha como la lluvia de fondo, but it's, it's fine, no worries. Gracias, okay. Clary. Thank you so much for siempre yeah. conectarse. Uh, Moses, gracias, Moses. There you go. Present. Thank you. Uh, Pedrina, si me Present, si teacher, problemas. present. Thank you. Present, Ahí está. Perfect, perfect. Me alegra verlo por aquí, Pedrina. So happy to see you. Yes, yes, yes. Um, René, René, René. Todavía no. Present, present. Hey, there you go. Hi, good evening. ¿Qué tal, René? Are you home? Yes. Yes, nice. I'm glad you're not working. Ricardo? Richard, sí, está ahí. So Richard is there. 
you, Richard. <laughs> okay, I think he's Hello, here. teacher. Hello, hello, hello. There you go. Thank you, Sandrita, Sandra, Miss Rodas. Present teacher. Good evening. Thank you. Good evening. ¿Qué tal, Sandrita? How are you? Very good, teacher. Nice. ¿No está lloviendo por allá? Not raining? Ok, ok, so creo que solo es en la zona de Huachapá, right? Probably. Um, Sonia Mabel. Present teacher. Thank you very much. And Ingrid, but I don't see her just yet. Ok, now I think we're good. Ok, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. Let's get started with the things we got for today. So let's comparto mi pantalla. Let me present my screen right here. So today, uh, tu, 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 let's get started. Vamos a revisar un poquito de vocabulario. Okay. And to get started, I have these, these pictures. And it says match the picture with the definition. So we have some common illness, right? No sé si a ustedes les pasa, but we get sick very often. O solo nos dan síntomas, so we get some symptoms. So let's take a look at this, okay? Um, we have, for example, I have a toothache, right? So this is a toothache. I have a stomachache. I have a cold, right? Like when you're like, oh, okay. I feel tired. I have a headache, yeah? I feel cold. So when you need like some chocolate or my leg hurts. First of all, let's take a look at this. Uh, how often do you get a toothache? How often do you get a toothache? So, ¿qué tan a menudo les duelen los dientes? How often do you get a toothache? Never, rarely, sometimes, uh, very often. Uh, once a month. Once a month. Once a month. Today, I have today. Me too, me too. Today, okay. Ricardo. Ooh. Yes, yes. You have Sorry. racket, Ricardo. Yes. Con este lambrerillo que ando. Ah, you have braces too. Yes. Okay. It is cierto. You said last time. Medio me lo feo y ya me duele. <laughs> okay. In, in in Spanish, normally le llamamos brackets, right? In English, <laughs> le podemos llamar braces. So they, these ones are called braces. Uh -huh. that's it, that's yes, guys, I think of brackets. <laughs> I have braces. Okay. I have braces. Creo que no se ven. No, no se ven en la cámara. Okay. <laughs> they are like super small. So I have braces. Okay, I so, have cadenas. Ah, you have like some braces chain. Me too. Me too. Oh. But, uh, anyways. Okay. Um, what about toothache, guys? No les duele muy a menudo? So you don't normally get a toothache? Yes. Not even in las cordales? Not even in yes. the wisdom teeth? Elimination, cordiales también. Okay, so you eliminated them. Yes, sí que voy okay. a llorar. Okay. Yeah, good, okay. English, good English elimination. Okay. So, yes. Well, podemos decir extract or eliminate, extract. that's perfect. Uh -huh. Extract, extract. So they were extracted. Okay. What about a stomach cake? When was the last time? When was the last time you were sick? ¿Cuándo fue la última vez que se enfermaron? Brenda, I know. Ah, <laughs> I immediately see you like, okay, I know. Quédate ahí, te, quédate know. ahí, Brenda. Una parte, okay. no, ese es bullying. Brenda, tú ya. Ese no. es bullying, bullying. No, what, what I'm saying is, I don't want to make des, her feel good. Está desarrollando, está desarrollando. But I know she's sick. So what about the rest of you guys? When was the last time you were sick? Puede ser algo bien sencillo, like a stomachache, like a toothache, like a headache, or you want to vomit. So when was the last time you were a little sick? Well, a flu? Like, oh, you got the flu. Okay, when? Last weekend. Oh, yes, I remember. Your voice was very deep. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I remember that. Uh, guys, what about the rest? Guadalupe, Pedrina, Mabel, Anita, se enferman seguido? Do you get sick? You know, very often? No, no really. Just not really. So when was the last time you were sick? One year ago, two years ago, six months ago? 
in my case. Uh, one year ago. One year, okay. December? Oh, Last December. Day. Okay, what, what was the problem? What was wrong? Did you get the flu? Like, or did you get a headache? A cold. COVID. COVID. Oh, you got COVID. <laughs> oh, what, which were the symptoms? Como se dice, este, dificultad de respirar. Okay, let me write it down para que les quede guardado al, al resto too. So that is uh, breathing, respirar is breathe. So breathing problems. Mm -hmm. Problemas para respirar. Breathing problems. Mm -hmm. um, fever? Uh, Did you get fever? Yes, fever. You got fever? Like um, sort of muscle? Sore, mm, sore muscle, dolor de, de músculo de cuerpo, sore muscle. Uh, leve. Mm, ok, ok. And head, como es dolor de cabeza, head headache. Dash. Headache. 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 Uh -huh. headache. Oh, ok. Mm. ¿Y así? Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear that, pero me alegra ver la que está, you know, and everything good. So I'm happy to see you there. Yeah, exactly. I mean, lo más importante es eso, that you get over, right? Que usted mm -hmm. se recupere. Yes. So, guys, let's match, right, the symptoms con la palabrita que tenemos ahí. For example, I have this picture. ¿Qué, es, qué representa? What does it represent? Teacher. Yes. Eh, en el chat puso una, pre, una, una, una palabra. Sobre, sobre, ajá, una palabra sobre muscle. Sobre muscle. Ajá. ajá. Me sore. levanté y no escuché. Oh, ok. Sore es dolor, pero no siempre se usa con todas las palabras. Por ejemplo, se puede usar con la garganta cuando digo tengo dolor de garganta. I have a sore throat. Sore, mm -hmm. sore throat. Y también sore. lo uso para el dolor del cuerpo, right? Cuando usted dice me duele el cuerpo, I have sore muscle. Guys, vamos a pronunciar esa palabra que es bien interesante. Eh, es sore. sore. Primero es sore. La segunda es más sol. Más sol. Más sol. Sor más sol. sol. Uh -huh. Más sol. Más sol. Exacto. Eso es músculo, ¿verdad? Right? Más sol. Ah, dice, uh -huh. y esa, a eso iba. Esa palabra se le puede... Se puede utilizar sola, no hay ningún problema. O sea, no. para referirte a los músculos. No, por ejemplo, you can say, ah. estoy trabajando mis músculos. Ah, I am working okay. with my muscle. Ajá, no, muscle. no hay problema, porque ah. muscle es el músculo. Uh -huh. Ok. So, sore muscle, sí. si es el dolor de cuerpo. Uh -huh. Yep. So, let's take a look at this one. Guys, ¿qué representa esta? Al llegar a los 30, todos, you know, <laughs> we get this, like, we, we really get to, to, to have a problem here. So, ¿qué le pasó a él? What is going on or what is wrong with this picture? From A to letter G. A, G, leg hurts. My leg hurts. Exactly. So, well, acá le duele la pierna. So, my leg hurts. But also, I can say different parts of your body. Um, I have a question for you in the chat. Everybody, help me. ¿Cómo se dice rodilla? How do you say rodilla in English? ¿Qué es lo que te duele? No sé cómo se pronuncia. Write it in the chat. Vamos al chat. Write it in the chat. In, in no, the chat. No, no. <laughs> oh, gracias, Carlos. Thank you. So, how do you say rodilla in English? In the chat, write it down, guys. Vamos a practicar un poquito de spelling también. So let's work with the spelling. How do you say rodilla? No, no, no. I don't see it. Yes, exactly, exactly. So esa es una ni. Uh -huh. So si quiero decir me duele la rodilla, so I can say my knee hurts. Lo mismo que acá, the same. Solo le voy cambiando que parte del cuerpo, right? If I want to say mi, la cabeza, me duele la cabeza, So, how do you say cabeza? Head. Uh -huh. So, my... Head. Head. Mm, Head. Sí, esa es una forma, pero la otra forma es tengo dolor de cabeza. So, Head. sería my hair. Usemos el ejemplo de la G. Heart. My oh, leg sorry. hurts. Head, sorry. My knee hurts. Oh. My, my head. 
my head. Your heart. 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 Okay. okay. Como la canción, you know? ¿La han escuchado? Love Heart. <laughs> okay. So, mm -hmm. no, come on, guys. Tienen que haberla escuchado. It's yes, from it the is. 80s. It's old school. <laughs> okay. So, podemos ir cambiándole la parte del cuerpo. If you want to say, for example, me duele la espalda. So, my... How do you say espalda? Back. 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 Oh, my back hurts, you know. If I want to say, me duelen los pies, how do you say pie? Uno. How do you say one? Sí. Uno. Foot. 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 Excellent. Foot. Exactly. Y dos. Foot. Feet. Feet. Very Feet. good. Foot es uno. Fit son los dos, right? No le agregamos S, solo cambiamos la palabra. Foot and feet. So I want to say, ay, me duele un pie. So my foot hurts. Me duelen los dos pies. So my feet hurt, right? So puedo utilizarlo, puedo irlo combinando this way para decir tengo un dolor en alguna parte del cuerpo. So we're good. Uh, this just say is letter G. What about this one? What is wrong? ¿Qué le pasa al niño? What is wrong with the boy? He has a cold. Very good. He has a cold. Exactly. Like resfriado, escalofríos. Okay. So that's good. What about this person? Se parece a nosotros en la mañana. It looks like us when we start working. What is wrong? What is the problem with this person? He's very tired. Exactly. Uh -huh. I feel very tired. Mm -hmm. So, um, no es que esté enferma, right? But just no. cuando trabaja mucho, when you work a lot, so you feel very tired. What about this person? What is wrong with this person? He has a touch heart. Mm, exactly. So this is letter A. I have a toothache. Oh, me duele el diente. My tooth hurts. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. What about the man? What about the man in the bed? What is this? Teacher. Yes? What is, what, what is the, the difference between I have a cold and I feel cold? Oh, it can be different because I got a cold. Es como tengo un resfriado. And when you say I feel cold, no necesariamente está enfermo. Solamente cuando usted vaya por el hospital, you know, oh, I feel cold, all right? So puede ser tengo escalofríos. It can be tengo frío. So no necesariamente estoy enfermo. Mm -hmm. But I have a cold. Ahí sí es un problema. <laughs> because that, then we are sick. Ya, ya vamos a revisar a little bit that part. Uh, what about this boy? ¿Qué le pasa a él? What is wrong with this boy? So, ya tenemos, I have a toothache. I feel very tired. My leg hurts. So, what about this one? Este niño, for example, he says, I feel cold, right? So, yo siento frío, I feel cold. Y este señor, what about this person? He has a cold. He has a cold. El sí es enfermo, el sí tiene un resfrío. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. What about this woman? ¿Qué le pasa a ella? What is wrong? She has a headache. Uh -huh. She has a headache. Exactly. I have a headache. And the last one, the woman touching her of, what about this? She has a stomachache. A stomach. Exactly. So she has a stomachache. Very good. So vamos a repetirlo. Let's practice pronunciation a little bit. Okay, there we go. So number one, I have a toothache. I have a toothache. I have a toothache. 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 
Toothache. Toothache. Ajá, toothache. Ok, esta última toothache. palabra, el H, no se pronuncia H. Lo vamos a pronunciar como un ache. Ache. Right? I have ache. a toothache. Toothache. A toothache. Mm -hmm. Toothache. Good, good, good. Second part, stomach. Stomach. Ahora le digamos ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Exactly. No es stomach chache, right? It's stomach cake. So I have a stomach cake. Stomach Me duele cake. el estómago. I have a stomach cake. Mm -hmm. Next I one. Have I have a cold. I have, I have a cold. cold. I okay. have a cold. Good. I, I feel very cold. tired. I feel, I feel very tired. I feel very tired. Mm -hmm. I have a headache. I have a headache. I have a headache. Very good. I feel cold. I feel, I cold. feel cold. cold. Tengo fríos o tengo escalofríos, right? And my leg hurts. My leg hurts. My leg hurts. Exactly, very good, 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 good. So here we have some of the most common, quizás, illness, symptoms, you know, que reportamos al trabajo. Then let's move on a little bit, porque vamos a ver más. We are going to check more. So, ¿cómo le digo a mi jefe? Hey, boss, no voy a ir a trabajar porque estoy enfermo. How can I say that in English? Very useful. Um, I got a question for you. ¿Al ¿Alguien le han dado incapacidad recientemente? Do no. you normally get medical leave? No? Yes, uh, sí, Oh, I remember. Good. I remember it's true. So, eh, incapacidad, en el sentido de estoy enfermo, voy al seguro, me dan un documento y no voy a trabajar, en English tiene dos nombres. You can say sick leave, right? Uh, se los voy a escribir. I'm going to write it down. Just give me one second. So, usted puede decir, I have a sick leave. So, eh, be careful with this word, porque sick leave es solo para eso, incapacidad del seguro, de me estoy enfermo, no voy a trabajar. No es que tengo una situación eh, de incapacidad física o que no me permita trabajar. So, di cosas diferentes, right? So, I have a sick leave, that is, tengo incapacidad. Or, I have a doctor's leave. I have a doctor's leave. So, ambas significa tengo incapacidad médica. So, no voy a ir a trabajar, right? Um, so, Clary, for how many days did you get your sick leave? Two weeks. Two, las dos semanas. Yes. Twelve yes. um, days. Wow, pero que, yes. that was a lot. I didn't know, yeah. pensé que solo por tres días. Wow, that was no. Long. Okay. Brian, did you get a sick leave? Uh, no. No. Last time, la última vez que estaba enfermo, you didn't get a sick leave. No. Oh, okay. What about Brian, the rest of the week? No fue la semana trabajar. What was that, Renee? Que dijo que, que, que perdón, no te escuché. <laughs> Es que la jefe está aquí, yo no sé. No, no, no. Ya, so, ya, ok. Sí, no, 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 sé, no, 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 cerca. Let's go Mañana hablamos. No, 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 so Mañana traiga a Luis Nilma. Y, okay. y todos los uniformes. No, let's move on. To be on the safe side. Okay, so if this is sick leave or doctor's leave, right? Like incapacidad. Again, no se refiere a incapacidad física de um, tengo algún tipo de, de dificultad para moverme, for example. No, this is you go to the doctor, you go to seguro, and they give you like a piece of paper. So um, this is a conversation uh, between a person calling her boss. Y le está explicando, vos, me pasó esto. This is, you know, the problem. No puedo ir a trabajar and I need to report it. So necesito dos voluntarios. I need two volunteers to read the conversation. Me, teacher. Thank you. Oh, let's do it. Perfect. So, Mabel, you are going to be the boss. And Brian, you're going to be the employee. <laughs> you are going to be Jani. <laughs> y de reivindicarse. 
No, es que se va a reportar ahorita. So you're going to report in, you're going to call in sick. And uh, okay, let's do it. <laughs> okay, I'm a star. Good morning, the, this is Mr. Lasso. Hello, Mr. Lasso. This is Brian. I had a situation. Hi, Brian. Tell me, what's the, what's the matter? And I'm not feeling well today. My stomach is killing me. I am a serious adult. Okay, I'm not understand. I don't think I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the water too. We did too. No oh. oh, really? There's something going all around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh yeah, I uh, I'm in tip top shape. 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 Yes, take, shape. It, it, take it easy, Brian. Take it easy, Brian. I hope to see you on Monday. Thanks a lot, Mr. Lass. Miss Lasso. Miss Lasso. Had a nice rest of the day. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> this is like exactamente su ejemplo. <laa> this is exactly like a real. Y que más incapacita es René. Oh. Oh. Oh, René está Marvin, es que no está, I think. Okay. No, okay. Marvin está incapacitado, ya. Ya, la puya. Ya está en el hospital. Ya, ya, ya se fue. Are, are you serious? Is he enfermo? Is he sick? No. <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm gonna. Hoy lo vi, yo me quedé. No, pero hoy lo vi. Uh -huh. Yeah, no, I, thought, I thought that you were real too. Okay, so mm -hmm. let's take a look at some expressions that the person used. Uh, first, uh, la pregunta que le hizo here was, hey, what's the matter, right? No le pregunta what's the problem, sino what's the matter? ¿Cuál es la situación? ¿Qué te pasa, right? What's the matter? In the sense of if there's a problem, what's going on? So what's the matter? Uh, and the person says, I'm not feeling well. Yeah, my stomach is killing me. Again, yo puedo cambiar esto y le puedo decir otra parte del cuerpo. So I can say my stomach is killing me. Mi espalda me está matando. My back is killing me. Guys, ¿qué es lo que normalmente les duele? What do you normally get problems with? Nothing. My head, my head, my head is killing me. But if in this moment I say some symptoms of COVID, uh, we take a quarantine. Yeah, well, unfortunately, that is the reality because with COVID, everything is so it's como más delicado, right? So every single thing is more difficult. Mm -hmm. So here we have, I am as sick as a dog. No es que esté enfermo como un perro. Um, quiero aclarar esta parte. La parte de I am as sick Eso as a dog. Eso le iba a decir dog, porque, ¿qué significado? Yes. Eh, se llama una expresión idiomática. This is an idiomatic expression. Y literalmente es, estoy muy enfermo. Me siento así como malísimo, reventadísimo, you know. So no lo traduzcan, don't translate it, porque es como, ay, yo no me siento como perro. No. I am as sick as a dog. Es como, estoy, pero así que ya no aguanto, you know. Really, really bad. Then the next person says, uh, two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. So weather is el clima, but here, también es una expresión idiomática. I, I was feeling under the weather too. Es como, yo también me sentía mal. Ya, yeah? a mí me pasaba lo mismo. So I, I was feeling... Under the weather too. Um, y como ahorita esto del COVID, you know, nos pasa a todos. As Carlos say, usted dice, I got the flu. Y pues todos están ya con flu. Or I got the a sore throat. Y de repente a todo el mundo es como, ay, yo también me duele. So, hay esa expresión. There is something going around. Ya, yeah? como está en el aire. Like, hay una epidemia. Something is going around. And then you say, oh, I hope you feel better. But yeah. I am in a tip-top shape. So tip-top shape is como, ya estoy perfect, yeah? I'm ready, I'm good. So I am in a tip-top shape. Y la última que tenemos es, take it easy. Guys, ¿qué significa take it easy? What is this? Suave. <laughs> in Salvadorian, yes. Es como, oh, tranquilo, yeah? Tranquilo. Relax. 
Ya, no pasa nada. Take it easy. Tómalo con calma. Mm -hmm. And that's it. That's pretty much the conversation. So, um, ayúdenme con el siguiente ejercicio. Help me with the following exercise. It says, vamos a matchar. We are going to match first las expresiones que tenemos con el significado, right? Así que a dog, eh, ¿con cuál de ellas iría? Under the weather, ¿con cuál vamos a utilizar? There is something going around. ¿Qué significa esa, right? Les doy cinco minutitos. I'll give you five minutes. Sorry, teacher, teacher, what what we do? Don't, don't hear it. I can hear uh, teacher. Esa fue la lluvia. Yes. ¿Cuántas gradas subió?
¿Me logran escuchar? Yes. Yes, teacher. Qué raro, super weird. Ok. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, está lloviendo un poquito acá, no sé si me van a lograr escuchar. I don't know if you will be able to listen to me because si sí está bastante fuerte, you know, it's like very, very heavy. So, ayúdenme con, los, con el vocabulario. Help me out with the vocabulary, please. Mm -hmm. Okay, so for the first, my stomach hurts badly. ¿Qué letra utilizaríamos? Uh, my stomach is killing me. My stomach is killing me. My is for? Yes, exactly. That is number four. Number two, to be very, very sick. ¿Cuál usamos para decir estado como muy, muy enfermo? Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number three, what about number three? Number, number five, five. Of change. Number, five. Mm -hmm. number uh, four, not feeling well. Utilizo para decir not feeling well. No me siento bien, I'm not feeling well. Number six. Number six. I can afford to. Uh, mm, hay no. otra expresión. There oh. is another. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm not feeling well. Como cuando digo, ah, yo también me sentía bien mal, you know. It was in the conversation. So, ¿qué otra expresión usamos? Dejemos esta y la revisamos al final. No hay problema. Number no, five. Under the, under the weather. Exactly. So, number under the two. weather. Okay. So, this is number two. Mm -hmm. Very good. In great condition. ¿Cuál de esas utilizo para decir in great condition? Tip-top shape. Very good. That is a tip-top shape. Dame un segundito. Solo muevo la computadora. Let me just move it. Okay. Yes, that is in a tip-top shape. So that is in great condition. Ya me siento como super bien. Number eight. Uh, next one. I don't have time to. No tengo tiempo para hacer nada. No me queda tiempo. So I. I don't have time. Can I afford to? I can afford to. Exactly. Oh my God. Se quiere la luz. Okay, number seven. Many people have the same thing. ¿Cuál uso para number seven? Para decir, oh, esto está en el aire. Number three. This is number three. There is something going around. Yeah, like, oh, muchas personas lo tienen. There is something going around. Y la última. Cuando llaman al jefe para reportarse enfermo, ¿cómo digo eso? How can I say that? Seven. Seven. Good. Calling sick. So, si alguien les dice, oh, I am calling sick, es como jefe, le estoy llamando porque estoy enferma. <laughs> ok, es una forma bien cortita de decirle, this is what is going on. Preguntas con vocabulario? Do you have any question with vocabulary? Uh, uh, can I for? Afford. La palabra afford es como, no me alcanza, y you no know, solamente la palabra afford. Pero en este contexto, I can afford to, es como yo no tengo tiempo para darme ese lujo, you know. So, no tengo el tiempo para perderlo. That is the, the meaning of this one. Eso, la expresión completa. Mm -hmm. Ok, ok, guys. Antes de seguir con el siguiente ejercicio, what I want you to do is the following. Quiero que escojan de estas ocho palabras nuevas from the eight expressions we have here. Escojan tres, cuatro, y uno con cuatro está súper bien. 
I want you to select four, que son las más nuevas, the ones that you didn't know, las que no conocíamos, and I want you to write like a short example utilizándola. For example, as sick as a dog, es como estoy muy enfermo. So I can tell you, oh, my, sick to, my sister today, she was having some a fever and she was having a headache when she came back. I think she's as sick as a dog. Maybe it's COVID. I don't know. So that would be the example, right? So as sick as a dog. Es, está muy enferma. So guys, eh, cuatro ejemplos. I want you to give me four examples. Cuatro oraciones utilizando las palabras nuevas, the new words. Si no saben qué significa, refirámonos nuevamente al ejercicio de abajo, que acá está el significado de ellas, right? So, cinco minutitos, five minutes. Uh, escuchen los truenos. <laughs> so, there are some lightning here and also some light thunders. Thank <clears throat> One more minute.
Hi, Marvin. <laughs> I, I was texting you, but Melera Kiyaseka. Happy to see you here. Thank you, teacher. Ya se calmó un poquito la lluvia también. Sí, ya se está quitando. Nice. Well, acá empieza, you know, it just started, but esperemos que nos dé tiempo para terminarla. Okay, guys, so estamos haciendo un par de ejemplos, right? So we are completing a couple of examples utilizando las expresiones. Me regalan un par de ejemplos. Can you give me some examples? Do you have like one, two? ¿Cuántos tienen? How many do you have? ¿Qué expresiones utilizaron? Or what expressions did you select? Vamos a utilizar las que están en rojo. ¿verdad? Las que están en rojo, correcto, que son las nuevas. The ones that are uh, below, estas están más fáciles, but so, significan lo mismo, right? So, ¿alguien tiene algo con as dick as a dog? My son as a sick as a dog. Mm, ok, very good. My son, le vamos a agregar el verbo to be. So my son is as sick as a dog. <ríe> Suena un poco extraño. <ríe> eh, pero eso, eso es como estar muy, muy enfermo. Ok, very good. Any other example? Y más tiene un ejemplo. My stomach is killing me. My head is killing me. My back is killing me. Any example, guys? Yes. 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 My, yes. My, my stomach is is killing me because yesterday I drunk a uh, Levántate Lázaro. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is Levántate Lázaro? <laughs> yes. Okay. From the Levanta Muertos. Yeah, ha have a uh, uh, orange, okay. eggs, Coca-Cola, etc. Uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, just, just to listen to the ingredients. I'm like, <laughs> okay, got it, got it. Thank you so much. Uh, okay, what about any other new expression? Más ejemplos, guys? Yes? Can I say, uh, yesterday my stomach was killing me. Yes, of course. Yesterday my stomach was killing me. Very good example. Okay, next, Norbert. Eh, Brendita, ¿tienen algún ejemplo para nosotros? Marvin, do you have any example for us? Rene? Me, teacher. Yes, tell me, Mabel. Um, I eat too much. No, my stomach is killing me. Mm, okay, I ate too much and now my stomach is killing me. Very good, good, good. Mm -hmm. ¿Alguien más? Anybody else? For example, teacher, in the... Uh... Uh, I don't, uh, I don't feel, you don't feel good mm -hmm. in I under the weather too. Okay. Okay. Yes. So it's like, oh, are you, well, I know you're sick. I know you're not feeling good. And I am under the weather too. Exactly. I like it. So para no repetir, oh, I don't feel sick tampoco either. So está super bien que lo cambiemos. I like it. Very good example. Thank you, René. Alguien más? Anybody else? My, my... The last weekend. The last weekend. Oh, sorry. My my teeth is killing me. Oh, my tooth. Mm -hmm. so last weekend, my tooth. Como es el, el anterior, verdad? Last weekend, podemos cambiarlo a was. Last weekend, my tooth was killing me. Me estaba killing matando. Me. Oh. Mm -hmm. Good, very good. Alguien tiene una con la número siete, Colin Sick. No, really? Okay, perfect. Not a problem. Okay, guys, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. We are going to now move on to the next activity. Vamos a hablar ahora. Now we are going to like speak a little bit. Give me one second here. And then we go for the next one. Okay, tengo solamente un poquito más de vocabulario. I, the, this is something that I want to share with you. So primero, ayúdenme con la pronunciación, por favor. Right? So repeat with me. Son solamente como síntomas. Number one, runny nose. Runny nose. Runny nose. Like, runny nose. <laughs> Number two, broken bone. Broken bone. Broken bone. Next one, bruise. 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 
no Bruce. tengo. Bruce, ok. Sunborn. 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 Next one, chills. 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 Next one, backcake. 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 Next one, nosha. 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 Next one, dizziness. Dizziness. Dizzy. Dizziness. Dizziness. Dizzy. Dizziness. Dizziness. There you go. Dizziness. Flu. Flu. ¿Cómo se pronuncia esta, guys? How do we pronounce this? Stomach cake. Stomach cake. Stomach cake. Stomach cake. Very good. Stomach cake. Okay. Next one. Fever. 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 Mm -hmm. Snake bite. Snake bite. A bite es como una mordida, right? So no necesariamente es solo de snake. Puede ser a dog bite. A mosquito bite. ¿Qué más los puede morder? What else? Una culebra. A mosquito, a snake, a dog. Mm, ok, let's leave it like that. And the Ay, last one. Arto, un lagarto. A lizard. Okay, a, a lion. Crocodile, un a lion. Pero una lion bite le arranca la mano. <laughs> ok. Fear. Uh -huh. a so beer. maybe a lion, a tiger, a bird. Uh -huh. Y la última que tenemos es cough. Ingrid, oh. hello. Yes, that is cough. 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 Como, como una F. Cough. Cough. Oh. Ok, exactly. So these are some illnesses. Ahora veamos qué significa super quick antes de irnos with the next activity. Runny nose. Ok, runny nose es cuando tienen como agüita. Yeah. You got the flu y tienen mucho, eh, mucho líquido, mucho... Yeah, pero es que runny es como cuando usted anda limpiándose. When you clean your nose every moment because hay líquido. There is some liquid, you know. Uh -huh. The other one, broken bone, Delicious. cuando se han quebrado. <laughs> Bien salty, <laughs> cuando se han quebrado un huesito, right? Bruce, what is a bruise, guys? Bruce son los moretes, los hematomas, cuando se caen, you know? You get some bruises on your skin. Eh, sunburn, right? Como cuando van a la beach. And you forget to put cream or sunscreen. Chills, like, right? Chills, like, it's very cold. Backache. Nausea, creo que eso no, le, no, no se pierden with them. Dizziness, ya, yeah? como cuando se marean. So, dizziness. Tengo mareos. So, I feel very dizzy. Yeah, I have dizziness. Then we have the flu, right? La, la gripa, so flu. Stomachache, fever. Snake bite, que son mordidas. And the cough. The so cough is like, <coughs> right? Cough. And that's cough. it. Yes, cough. Como con una F. Cough. That's it, guys. Pero Get back. Back. Cake. back. Back. Uh -huh. Cake. Siempre que vean ache, es como dolor. Yeah? So, stomach, cake. Oh, dolor de estómago. Back, cake. Oh, dolor de espalda. De so, back, cake. Mm -hmm. Okay. There Gracias. we go. No worries. Okay, guys, following exercise. Vamos a hacer lo siguiente. You are sick and call into your workplace to explain the situation. So, vamos a hacer el mismo ejercicio that uh, Brian did with Mabel some minutes ago. You attend the call and ask your classmate what the matter is and use the idioms in the conversation. No vamos a, no vamos a copiarla. Esto no es un copy-paste. <laughs> Ok, vamos a utilizar la, la conversación como un ejemplo de cómo puedo expresar o cómo le puedo decir a mi jefe, jefe, me estoy muriendo, you know. So, um, take a couple of ideas, por ejemplo, hey Ingrid, what's going on? What's the matter? And then you can use other expressions, like, boss, I feel terrible, boss, I'm dying, my head is killing me, I have a terrible fever. And I have some cough. So vamos a agregarle más síntomas, right? Or like when you feel bad, for example. Let me see. A mí no me duele. Oh, yeah, me duele la rodilla. So, <laughs> boss, I cannot walk. I feel really bad. My knee hurts a lot. 
I did exercise and I feel terrible. Okay. I need to go to the okay. doctor. So, vamos a explicarle. We are going to explain. And vamos a utilizar cuantas se puedan. No necesariamente todas, pero vamos a agregar estas expresiones de en negrito, tantas como sean posibles. ¿Estamos bien? Are we good? Yes. So, esto es de acá. You are sick and you call in your workplace. Imagínense que realmente le están llamando a su, a su jefe, right? Y le expliquen, jefe, me pasa eso. So this is what is going on. Uh, la pueden escribir, you can write it down. Si ya se sienten más cómodos hablándolo, it's perfect. You can definitely go for it. But uh, please remember que esa la vamos a presentar. So everybody will be presented today. So, vámonos, let's go. Tienen 10 minutos para prepararla. You got 10 minutes. Yes, yes, tell me. Okay. Mm. Sorry, but I... mm. Okay. Bye, entonces sería ahorita. Quiero ver, dice, tal vez le dijera good morning, good morning, boss. Eh, good morning, boss. Um, ¿Cómo lo puedo surtir? I push. Um, when did uh, you tell you um, hospital? Puede ser um, como, I'm post. sorry, hi. <laughs> Hola Ingrid, me alegra verla por acá. Super happy to see you. Puede ser como, I will go. So vos, I will go. I will go, okay. I will go to the hospital um, because it's, um, I have fever. Fever, fever, fever. Fever, uh, fever. Uh, fever. Uh, and cold. Uh, and cold. ¿Cómo puedo decir? ¿Cómo era nosotros? And how much? Uh, money. Money es mucho, ¿verdad? Money o mucho. De. De. I have how much? Yeah. I have much. I have oh. much in nausea, in nausea and dizziness, um, fever, fever, um, and cold. I I want to. Give a permission, I don't know, yo creo. Ah, okay, entonces, I have, um, you can ask like, I, I want to request. I need, puede ser como, oh, I need permission. 
or I need to request for permission. So, estarían bien. If I have uh, permission, uh, my boss. But you need to permission today or uh, tomorrow? You will go to the no, hospital today, uh, today, in the afternoon. Today, boss. Today, boss. today. Sí. it's good. It's good, but I I need you give me your inability inability tomorrow. If you 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 will go to the hospital. It does it, that it doesn't that is is my problem it doesn't matter for this but tomorrow i need you in ability oh no you, no you today. mean you mean like la incapacidad yes oh got it got it podemos usar la palabra um, it is in the chat no sé si la logra ver podemos usar la palabra sick leave o podemos usar la sick palabra leave. yes we can use sick leave for the document, right? The incapacity of the So tomorrow I need your sick leave or I need your doctor's leave. Cualquier de ellos está bien. That would be fine. Doctor, doctor. Doctor's leave. Hours, oh, yes. oh, hours uh, two minutes. I'm sorry. Uh, um, and I have the uh, hours, hours two. Hours two. Hours. Ah, que quiere todos los detalles. <laughs> ok. No, René hizo difícil voz. Me salió sin gente. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it's ok. It's good. Para que sienta. <laughs> no, that's ok. Ok. Oh, no, no problem, boss. Eh, eh, no problem. O sea que con eso me voy a levantar de la cama rapidito. Yeah. <ríe> me termino de enfermar. Get up, get up, get up of your bed quickly. Quickly. I don't think so. Qué pose mágica okay. le está dando. <ríe> Ay, God. Levántate, Lázaro. Yeah, in the to Metro Centro is the is the restaurant. Okay, but this is but this bad example. Take it easy, Brenda. Okay. Take it easy. Uh, hey Moses, come on here. <coughs> oh, miss, but I can listen to your cough still. So you're still coughing. Uh, Brenda? What teacher? Yeah, but you Sorry. are a, no, no, no. It's okay. You are still coughing, right? Do you have cough? Cough. Yes. Like yeah, la cough. La tos. La tos. Uh, so you yes, still yes, have cough. Oh. Okay. Okay. Es que solo estaba diciendo a Ignacio que tengo todos los males que están en, en esa lista. <laughs> en serio. I have a cough, I have a fever, I have a flu, I have a nausea, y I have a dizziness, no sé cómo se dice. Dizziness, tiene mareos, yes. like. Yes, teacher. Okay. ¿Por cuánto tiempo <laughs> le dieron incapacidad? When, when is, or how long is your medical leave? Only, uh, I have sick leave. Only three days. Oh, but it's been <laughs> short. It's like very short. Yes. Va a seguir yendo? Will you continue going there? Mm. Va a pedir que le extiendan? No, teacher. Not anymore? I have a, no, I have a seat, but uh, 
como le digo, I have, uh, no sé, me siento aburrida de estar en la casa, como le digo. <risa> so you are bored. Bored, yes. ¿Por qué? The, the, Why? The women, the, and no, the women I are strong. I, I, I feel, I feel more, more sick, no, more, yes, sí, así se dice. sick, yes, 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 <laughs> why? Estar en la casa, no sé por qué. But in your house you can do more activities, right? Like the cleaning, the washing, the washing up. Mm. Pues estos días no, no he tenido ganas de hacer absolutamente nada, la verdad. Oh. <laughs> Solo con nada pasado. Quizás por eso, maybe that is why. Mm -hmm. Pero yo diría que necesita reposo. I think you need some rest. Sí, la verdad es que a ver cómo, cómo me siento mañana. Si no, me va a tocar ir otra vez al seguro porque tampoco quiero ir a contaminar a la gente del trabajo. Ajá, uh -huh, that's another thing. Igual en el trabajo no creo que ellos quieran. O la van a mandar a la casa, most likely. That is another possibility. Ajá. Uh -huh. Because más con los últimos cambios, right? That están pidiendo... More controls and everything. So, es otra posibilidad as well. All right. Uh, yes. So, we got this. Guys, eh, ¿quién era el jefe y quién se reporta enferma? <laughs> like Brenda and Ignacio. So, Brenda, usted se reporta enferma. <laughs> Ignacio. Sorry. Oh, Ignacio is reporting sick. Really? No. Pero no. me estaba hablando del, del, del remedio milagroso. <risa> para, para que se le quiten. <risa> ok. So, no, okay. Eh, today, today at the, at the need day, it's mm -hmm. correct, it's need day. Yes. We, uh, we play in football soccer on, in the in the company mm -hmm. and this moment i i have a, a leg hurt so your leg hurts oh okay okay yeah that is the problem when you do exercise that your legs start hurting so i did exercise today y me lastimé la rodilla so my knee hurts i mean no solo es el ejemplo <laughs> by literally no, my no. knee hurts Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, I you, did. You, teacher, you're running um, in your, sorry, in, in your weekend. Um, I am going to the gym. So, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm going to the gym in the afternoon. And on the weekend, I run or I do exercise. But today, I did something bad and I hurt my leg. So my 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 knee, you know, not my leg. So my knee hurts. Neck. And, and your back, uh, no, to use the machine in the gym. Uh, yeah, we do use some machines, <laughs> but I did it with the belt. So estábamos usando como las, las belt, right? Las pesitas. Mm -hmm. That was why. But anyways, anyways, guys. Okay. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. it works. So, uh, at the end, va a ser al revés. <laughs> so, Brenda no se va a reportar, sino que usted se va a reportar. <laughs> okay, perfect. So, that's just fine. Guys, los dejo para que practiquen un momentito en el see you in five. En eso, tal vez, Carlos and Moses, they can join us and they can also participate. So, give me one moment. Vale, entonces Norbert, ¿dónde vamos a quedar? No, eh, hay, que, hay que continuar. Yes. Vale, por ejemplo, eh, tú me dices que, ok, eh, understand, understands eh, today. Today, um, 
Eiko, eh, I was feeling. Yes. Eh, y entonces, eh, lo, uh, lo vamos a dejar así como estaba, o lo vamos a cambiar. No va a entrar eh, la compañera. Sí, le vamos, vaya, después que yo te, después que yo te contesto tus... Yes, yes. Tus preguntas, eh, de ahí este entra, entra Ana Delmi. Vale. Uh -huh. Ok, está bien. Vale, entonces sería, eh, tú inicias, por decirlo así, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. eh, con Good Morning is eh, Mr. Only this, mm, eh, Mr. Alexis. Yes. No, Hello, uh, here, morning this, Mr. Norbert. Norbert, Norbert, okay, Norbert. okay. Mr. Uh, Norbert. Okay, uh, hello, Mr. Norbert. He is uh, Alexis. I have a situation. Okay, uh, entras tú. Yes, um, hi, Alexis. Yes. Philip was the mayor, the mayor. Yes, I know Phil with today. My Ken, my Ken, creo que se Ken, en rodilla. Uh -huh. kill me. I am, uh, no, pero ahí tendría que cambiarle porque dice que es enfermedad. Tendría que ser sore, que dolor. Uh -huh. Ok, ahorita. I am uh, sore. Sore. Um, bueno, no sé si se puede poner así, pero sí lo voy a decir. I am as sorry as a dog. Hi, guys. <laughs> no, I was here. No solamente estuve eh, escuchando, you know, for some minutes, en caso que necesitaban ayuda. Eh, solo lo quiero interrumpir. <laughs> no, yes. eh, sí, como me imagino que va a hablar de la rodilla, o puede perfectamente utilizar la palabra pain, que es dolor. Tengo un dolor. I have a pain. In my knee. Y eso es perfecto. Uh, oh, la de oh, la del perrito. <ríe> no lo cambiamos. So, I am a sick as a dog. Or, ah, lo, puedo, Nor lo puedo dejar así. Norberto, <ríe> sí, pero creo que usted le había puesto sore. Y sore uh -huh. si no se puede. Sore no. Ah, ok, mm -hmm. ok. Ok, capiche. Pero las demás estamos súper bien. The rest, we are good. Capiche, mm -hmm. capiche. Yes, yes, yes. Ok. Vaya, entonces, uh, ahí tendría que entrar la compañera ya con todos los poderes. <risa> Vaya, Anita. No sé si está Anita acá. A I mí mean, la veo, pero no la escucho. Es que no hear. Teacher. Yes. Uh, what's the matter or what's the matter? No, what's the matter? The matter. Yes, what's the matter? Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Hello, Miss Anadelmi. Okay, no problem. Listen, listen. Vaya, entonces sigamos. Pues. Yes. Inventemos aquí qué más le podemos meter. Okay, on the train. Today, ago, I was feeling in the train, in the way to. Eso lo podemos dejar así, creo yo. Ah, no, pero como ahí entra, como no está entrando ella. Eso lo podemos dejar así. Eh, y yo solo te digo que okay, es ready. Y lo dejamos hasta ahí. Digo yo, bueno. Pues. Ah, creo que 
vamos a poner mm, ok listen ok ready uh, broken bone uh, no ya, ya copiaste acá las la cosas ¿no? Orbel. Después, después, después que tú dices, ok, understand, today ago I was feeling, under day, we actually two. Entonces, yo te voy a responder, ok, really, uh, eh, to rest a comment, and they take the medicine tomorrow, I present the disability, que es la incapacidad. O sea, que va a tratar de reposar en la casa y tomar el medicamento y mañana te presenta la incapacidad. Y ahí tú me puedes eh, contestar, está bien, que sigas mejor, no sé. Ok. Eh. Eh, chicos, solo Pero una cosita es. adicional, sorry. <risa> ok, con lo de disability. Disability es cuando usted tiene problemas eh, de movilidad, digamos. Ah. Cuando, le, por ejemplo, le falta un brazo, le falta una pierna, eh, no escucha bien. Pero sí es como que usted fue al seguro es. y del seguro le dieron el papelito para que no vaya a trabajar. Entonces sí, le sí, llamamos entiendo. Doctor's Leave. Esa es la famosa Doctor's Leave. Sí, sí, Doctor's aquí Sleeve. lo tengo. Se me ha olvidado, no lo he encontrado. Ah, ok, perfecto. No hay problema. No, 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 you're good. Solo para, you know, okay, clarify eh, that. Es, es level, es uh -huh. level, así es. Exacto, es el leave. Ajá, Doctor's Leave. 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 Correcto. Leave. Very, very, very good. Eh, I present the level. Entonces, yes. día, Ricardo, I am have, I am have a Doctor's Leave. Ajá, lo voy a cambiar. Yo tengo una incapacidad. Headache, uh -huh. headache. Headache, 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 I am not feeling today. I had a flu and fiber. My head is killing me. Please, call it contact with my boss. I'm sorry. I hope you feel better. Wait a minute, please. <laughs> Hi, Brian. How are you? I am not feeling today. I had a flu. My head is killing me. In this moment, I am going to the hospital. Oh, really? Take it easy. Could you call me to report about your health? Of course. Thank you. 
Okay, I hope you feel better. Bye bye. Thanks, Miss. Bye. Oh. Hi, I really love the <laughs> ring ring. How was that? <laughs> es como la transferencia. <laughs> este But es el, I like it. <laughs> But that is that is very it's como bien genuino. <laughs> it sounded like bien very interactivo. Hmm? I really like it. De repente que va a sentir como que era una llamada like ring ring. <laughs> very cool, very cool stuff. Guys, ¿están no, listos? No, no la quería no la quería decir, va a creer, no quería transferir la llamada y eso es lo que le <laughs> e e Eso es la cereza. Yes. Yes. Del pastel. Okay. <laughs> ¿Están listos? Are you ready, guys? Yes. Yes, I'm ready. Perfect. Vamos no, a regresar. Nos escuchó. Solo no un escuch pedacito. El inicio, no. I didn't listen to that. Escuché como del el ring ring y un pedacito más. <laughs> <laughs> Para bueno. Escuchó lo mejor. No hay problema. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> Um, so, hi guys, gracias por regresar. Thank you so much for coming back. Uh, me faltan algunos, I'm still missing some. Hello, hello. Let me confirm que ya todos regresamos. So, let me just make sure. No, me hacen falta todavía algunos. Okay, guys, ¿cómo les fue con su práctica? ¿Ya lo tiene listo? Do you have it ready? Ready. Okay, great, great, great. So that is really good news. Y escuché algunas conversaciones que estaban like super, super cool. Así que let's go ahead and let's listen to a couple of, you know, the ones we got there. Ok, so let me see, déjenme confirmar si ya todos están de regreso. Ta -da -da -da. Yes, everybody's back. Ok, guys, eh, first, um, let's go ahead and let's present this. Remember, nunca sabemos cuando nos vaya a tocar eh, reportarnos en inglés, so we never know. Probably no with this, no with your current boss, tal vez en su trabajo futuro, you know. Or con alguien más, like at the embassy, I don't know. We never know what's going to happen. So, voluntarios, who, ¿quién quiere comenzar? Who wants to get started? Y si no, pues víctimas son bienvenidas. <laughs> do I have any volunteers? Nosotros, teacher. You can okay. do it, René. Eh, perfect, perfect. So, Brian, eh, Mabel, ¿quién más estaba con ustedes? Who was in your group? Guadalupe. Me. Guadalupe. And Lupita. Okay, very good. So let's get started. Good morning, this is Brian. I had a situation. Good morning, Brian. This is Sonia. How can I help you? I am not feeling today. I had a flu and fiber. My head is killing me. Please call. I contact with my boss. I'm sorry. I hope you feel better. Wait a minute, please. <laughs> Hi Brian, how are you? I am not feel today. I had a flu, my head is killing me. In this moment, I'm going to the hospital. Oh, really? Take it easy. Could you call me to report about your health? Of course, thank you. I hope you feel better. Thanks, miss. Bye bye. Bye. I like it. Thank you so much. That is just fine. And I, I really like the toot toot. <laughs> I really like that person. Es la transferencia. Careful, Brian. <laughs> I like the sound because lo hace más realista, you know, it makes it, you made it more real. So that was just fine. Bueno. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Um, siguiente, who wants to be next? Ingrid, you can do it, Renee. Are you ready? 
Yes, Ajá. ok. Y okay. todavía es como, maybe. <ríe> ok, Ingrid. No sé si está René para Yes, yes, I, yes, yes. I am here. Yes. Okay. Hi, hello. Okay. Uh, hello. Hello, good morning, boss. I was uh, sick. Hi, my permission to go to the hospital. Because you... I have, I have ever um, called now to um, back, back and business. Are you sick now? Yeah. Are you sick now? Uh, which part of your body uh, uh, pain? Heart. 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 Mm -hmm. Heart. No, 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 What part of your body hurts? Oh yes, oh yes. Um, no, no, um, permission, most. Yes, I, I, give permission you, but I need your doctor is uh, doctor is leave tomorrow in the morning. Oh yes, I said. Um, um, no, como está, no problem. Yo, um. Mm -hmm. I will do the disability uh, and the 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 perturb time, no problem. That's that's okay. Yeah, but you you have a uh, COVID? No. Oh no. ¿Cómo se dice? The, Espero que no, Miss. <laughs> I hope to. I to hope know. I don't. Uh huh. Yeah. No. <laughs> No. But, uh, uh, for me, know. does for me doesn't matter. You you can go to the doctor, and I hope you will better tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. Yes. I said no. No problem. That's okay. That's Thank it. you, boss. Thank you, guys. That was really nice. So. I really like that you started asking more questions like ¿Qué parte del cuerpo le dolía? What part of the body, like, you know, hurt? So, esa palabrita hurt es como doler. What part of your body hurts? Like, oh, my head, my back, my stomach. So, very nice job. You did it nicely. Thank you, Ingrid. Thank you, Renee. That was very cool. Um, Next, let me see. I got, I got Anita. Anna, Norbert, and Richard. ¿Están listos? Are you ready, guys? Okay. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, ready. Mr. Alexis. Good morning, yes. Mr. Alexis. Uh, hello, Mr. Norbert. This is uh, Alexis. I have a situation. Uh, Hi Alexis, tell me, what's the matter? Uh, yes, I am not feel with two with today. My camps is killing me. I am sick a uh, dog. Your house a uh, uh, dogs live? Okay, really. I will uh, rest at home and take the medicine. Tomorrow I have sit and leave it. Yeah. Okay, you sit leave uh, is uh, is the 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 is or or the or the clinic. Um, is a um, seguro eh, social, socially. Okay. Okay. Uh, very well. Your oh. show, show get up when finish your, uh, your, is, is live. Uh, okay. 
Thank you. Alos, Norbert. Bye. Okay, goodbye. Okay. Very nice. Okay, that was very cool. Thank you, guys. So you were asking about ease, about extra clinics. Okay, cool. I like that you also use the word uh, doctor's sleeve. So good. Guys, remember, disability, la palabra disability no la utilizamos en este contexto, a menos que estamos hablando de problemas de motricidad, eh, que, por ejemplo, una, visa, una disability es que usted no escuche bien, que no vea, eh, que no tenga o le falte un miembro del cuerpo, right? Like an arm, a leg, etc. So, esa es una disability. Pero si hablamos de eh, incapacidad, no discapacidad, sino incapacidad, so that would be doctor's leave or eh, sick leave, que son las más comunes. So, very good job with that. That was nice. Um, let me see. I'm missing... Me falta un grupo. I'm missing Brenda's group. So Brenda, Carlos, Ignacio, and Moses. You can do it, Brenda. <laughs> okay, let's hey, do it. <laughs> hey, Brenda. Brenda. Hello, Ignacio. Okay. Um, I speak to you because you, you, you are my boss. And uh, I need permission to visit to go to the doctor because okay. this morning uh, I uh, don't I I don't will me um, the stomach is, is killing me really why I don't know, maybe yesterday I drank a Joyce. It's a, it's a bad Joyce. What? Um, I don't know, because the Joyce have a eggs and the Coca-Cola is, mm. the, the, the mix is done good, but uh, I need your permission. Uh, I need go to the visit the doctor. And um, I, I I don't know if your the doctor uh, have a sick leave. You know. I don't know if the doctor give me the three days or maybe seven days. What? <laughs> Do you okay, have tomorrow? to leave? Uh, yeah, but tomorrow um, I get in, say, get in. The sick leave. Getting this. I don't know what say. Le, le llevo la incapacidad. The sick leave. Or okay. the doctor's leave. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. The, tomorrow I, I get in the sick leave of the doctor. Okay, Ignacio. Thanks. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, good, good, good boss. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That was really nice. Yeah, she's a really good boss. Eh, because I heard René, René was like, okay, pero que tiene? <laughs> Bring me the sick leave, you know. Oh, that was very nice, that was very cool. I like it, very good use of vocabulary too. Guys, ya nos faltan 12 minutitos nada más. We have just a couple of more minutes. And uh, tengo dos preguntitas for you. I got two questions and I would like to listen to your opinion. Number one says, have you broken a part of your body? Estamos hablando de... Um, something yeah. that happens, right? So have you have you broken a part of your body? No, how? No, yes. you haven't. Yeah, yes. what yes. part? Yes. Where? Tell me, what part of your body? Um, flying, uh, An arm, soccer, a leg. Soccer, you were playing soccer. soccer. Yes. Uh, ¿Cómo se llama? Espérenme que se me olvidó la parte del cuerpo. ¿Cómo se dice? Pero, <risa> pero, pero. Not even in Spanish. 
In my case, when I was a child. Antes de eso. Uy, llorar alcohol. So you broke your. Guys, do you know the meaning of alcohol? ¿Saben cuál es su alcohol? Sprain. No. Oh, you broke it or you sprain it? Sprain it. You sprain it. Your ankle sí, is el tobillo. Yes. So your ankle is your tobillo. Um, three, three months uh, level. So you have three months of sick leave. Eh, level is incapacidad. Sick no. leave. Sick leave. Sick leave. Sick leave. Or doctor's sick leave. leave. Yes, uh -huh. yes. Eh, three months uh, home. And... Pero estaba spray, no estaba quebrado. No, no, pero estuve... Eh... Sí le pusieron yes, o you got the cast. Yes. Mm, ok. Eh, se, se dice... Uh, eh, spleen. Spleen, uh, colocation, uh, anchor. Spleen. Like yes, split. Spleen, spleen. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you didn't get. So you didn't get the yes. cast. So guys, uh, what what Ricardo is saying? Tenemos esta palabrita, right? Que es broken, que es como fracturada, quebrada. But he said sprain. So sprain is solo como eh, dislocada. Let's say, ya yeah, somos vidita, right? And that is the ankle. Se las dejo por ahí. Ese es su tobillo. That is your ankle. Um, anybody else? ¿Quién más se ha quebrado? Have you broken a part of your body? Me, teacher. No. Uh, what part of your body did you know did you break? I broke my right arm. Ooh, playing? Yes, es mm. <coughs> ¿Cómo se dice? Teacher. Manejando okay. bicicleta. Oh, es, riding a bicycle. Yes, so riding teacher. a bicycle. Wow. Teacher, uh, I, I am broken my finger. You have broken your finger. finger. So which playing, finger? Play, playing playing football soccer. That that's playing soccer. Yeah, your that's, your that's, your pinky? My finger. This. What is that one? The ring one. Oh the ring one. Okay. Oh, okay. So fingers, eh, ankles, arm. Any other part of your body that you have broken, guys? Brian said no. Anybody else? Have you broken no, any other part? No, I, I don't broken. Mm -hmm. So you haven't? You haven't broken? How, how do you say muñeca? The wrist. The wrist. Yeah, the wrist. Really? You broke your wrist? Yes. Why? What were you doing? Uh, uh, when I was a child, I... I... Estaba bajando cocotes y me caí. You were collecting cocotes. Uh. Roba por robar. And you broke your wrist. No, me da, me cagaron. Me metí a robarlo de los vecinos y, y oh, me lo agarraron. Oh, es, es, que, es, que, es que yo oí que la rama estaba quebrando, pero pensé que Marvin estaba bromeando. Y... Oh, so you were with Marvin. Ah. Okay. Por eso es que Marvin tiene un gran aquí, ¿ah? ¿eh? Los dos se cayeron. <laughs> René, cara, René, ¿qué hizo Marvin? What did Marvin do? Se puso a reír nada más. <laughs> Se puso a reír nada más. So he laughed. He didn't help you. ¿Qué no mano ayudó? te quebraste? La like le de left. Oh, but the wrist, right? Ah, pero like menos con la derecha wrist. terminaste de comerte los opotes. <laughs> de que, que. René, como dice el dicho, dice. De que si tu amigo no se ríe cuando, cuando te caes, no es tu amigo, entonces. Ah, <laughs> And it's his brother. Yes. <laughs> is his brother, not a friend, but a brother. Okay. Okay, guys, y la última question, the last question we got. Have you lied? What is the meaning of lied? No, mentir. Mentir. Have you lied about being sick? Let's be honest. No. <laughs> no <laughs> never. Like when we want to get the sick leave, no, no, siento no, a Brian y a René como bien no. <laughs> yo, yo siento que es momento de confesar. 
Si no estuviera mi jefe, yo diría no, pero no. Y mañana llevo todo preparado. Tú y mi... No, teacher. Brian, llevé la cajita ya sin case. <risa> no, no, eso es mentira. Oh, Ignacio got frozen there. Okay, no, I mean, be because I know some people who have done it. I mean, they have lied, probably because they don't want to go to a party, because they don't want to work, o quieren ir al, al, al estadio. Did you see the news? Que una señora había ido al estadio. That a person lied about a sick leave and she went to the stadium. Quizás no. You didn't see the news. No vieron la noticia. No. Oh, okay. And she was fired porque apareció en todas las cámaras del estadio. <laughs> so she appeared <laughs> like señora. in the news. Put her, put her. Porque era el partido de, I don't remember, Spain or England. I don't remember. But it was this year. Eh, sorry, Ignacio, creo que quería comentarnos algo. Quería confesar algo. ¿no? Uh. Quería confesar el confession time. <laughs> <laughs> Open uh. your heart. <laughs> so tell uh. us. About the second, uh, the second the question. Second. Oh, see, si era una confesión then. Mi teacher, <laughs> okay. mi, mi teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Eh, con yeah. mi edad, alguna vez mentí sobre estar enfermo. ¿verdad? Okay, so you lied. You, I mean, <laughs> creo que es, es, es cosa de tiempo, es cosa I, de tiempo, I, pero I alguien think, tiene que usar esa estrategia. I think it's <laughs> very, very common, right? In a way, Ingrid, cuéntenos cuál es el tip. <laughs> Es que, es que, es que eso, eso no se cuenta mira. So let's chat And you tell us the strategies So that is going no, to be Learning strategies O sea, sí, he mentido nada más que La última que me recuerdo es que, que Mentí que estaba enferma porque Me levanté tarde, me desperté tarde <laughs> uh, Ok And what, what happened me tocaba, <ríe> me tocaba entrar a las siete y media y me levanté a las siete y veinte, entonces le llamé. ¿Qué hizo? Dije, pero es que estaba, es que le estaba tocó ir al seguro. Me tocó, sí, en serio, me tocó ir. Y le mandé ah, okay. una foto hasta que ya estaba en el seguro, solo entré y volví a salir. <ríe> What? Oh my god, eso no me la eso, eso, no, eso, no es no, no, eso no se hace. Eso oh my no god, era necesario, era necesario. Era necesario. Well, well, that, that, is, necessary. that is new to me, pero creo que en algún momento, um, we have probably done it, but yeah, yeah. Eso, eso sí es nueva. I didn't know you could do it. <laughs> Okay, guys, uh, it is about time. Unfortunately, time runs pretty, pretty fast. So, nos quedan tres minutitos. Ayúdenme con su cámara. Please give me some confirmation que estuvieron acá para que no se me quede nadie, you know, without um, getting the final attendance. Tu -ru -ru -ru. Eh, adelantando un poquito, creo que hay una de las tareas que les está causando como problemita, que les está dando un par de issues, ya probaron como con todas las posibilidades y todavía no les no. estoy pendiente con ustedes eh, con ese ejercicio ya les comento cuál es because tengo que revisarlo I have to check it out probablemente you are right on that so mientras solo me regalan confirmación guys eh, Anita Anita, la acabo de ver. Uh, quizás se le fue el Inter. Oh, well, no, right. Oh, yeah, she's right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Brenda. Present. Thank you. Brian. Present. Thank you. Carlos. Present. Thank you. Ya escuché a Brian así como bien desanimado. Like, Ay, mi cajita para mañana. You know? No, no. Estoy pensando. <risa> está estoy pensando, pensando que le va digo, a decir mañana. Digo, ¿Qué le digo ahora? Sí. Y esta semana, ¿qué le digo? Y ahora, ¿qué digo? <risa> y ahora, ¿qué digo? Ok. Uh, ya ocupé todos los comodines. Mis, mis, oh. Con lo que acabo de decir. Era tomar me fotos. Que estaba... <risa> perdón, perdón, Ingrid. I couldn't hear no, 
Ven que, ven que con lo que acaba de decir se me olvidó que estaba Pedrina y Magna ahí, que son de recursos humanos. Man, ya no le van a creer a sus empleados cuando le digan que están enfermos. Yo no le creo. A, a, el comodín es la, la inyección, teacher. A, a, ahorita, inyección. ¿usted qué cree? Ahorita tomando nota de cuáles son las técnicas. <risa> <risa> ya sin no, que... no crea, Magna, es mentira. Ya aquí, oh, ya aquí no se pudo Pedro. conectar, right? No, no, no worries. I mean, eso fue hace mucho tiempo, right, eh, Ingrid? <ríe> eh, Jocelyn, vi a Jocelyn un momento, but I didn't see her. Oh, Ignacio? Present teacher. Ay, no, thank you. Norbert? Present teacher. Thank you. Marvin Bonilla? Uh, Marvin didn't come. Marvin López? Acabo de ver a Mr. López. Probably he left. Um, Clary? Clary, Clary? Hello, Miss. I am here. Hello, thank you. Ya bajó la lluvia, right? So ya se calmó un poquitín. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nice. I'm glad to hear that. Uh, Moses is there. Pedrina? Present teacher. Thank you. René? Present, present. Thank you so much, Marvin. Okay. Eh, present, present. Ricardo, yes. <laughs> Sandra. <laughs> Sandrita. Present teacher. Thank you. Mabel. Present teacher. Thank you so much. And Ingrid. We got Ingrid. Thank you, guys. So, agradecerles enormemente Thanks, por la Ingrid. nice attendance de esta semana. Solamente nos quedan dos días más y luego la próxima semana. We are like running super, super quick. Um, now, tengo one on one. Ahora es miércoles. Tiene un segundo. Uh, con Jocelyn. Ok. So, um, hay un ejercicio, les comentaba anteriormente, que les está dando dificultades. en that is with, call it a day. How to use phrase numbers. El, el do del 14, 14, el, el, el eh, número 14, es, right? Number 14. Es el que vamos a revisar el día de mañana. So, the exercise that we are checking tomorrow es el número, el número 2, ¿verdad? 12, el número 2. Tiene toda la razón. You are totally right. 3, 4, 5. Eh, y si no lo marcan, les aparecen los 20 puntos. O les aparecen solo 16. Solo 16 nos aparece. Ok, bye. Regálenme. 16 nada más. Regálenme el día de mañana. Voy a escalarlo porque si sí, tienen toda la razón, el ejercicio no, eh, no está calificado. Entonces no, no les va a aparecer a ustedes nada más. So I'm going to, lo voy a reportar and I will let you know tomorrow cuando ya esté listo y para que les quede la nota completita. So creería que solo es ese, right? Yeah, es el de Phrasal Birds. Ok, everybody, gracias por su tiempo. Thank you so much. Que duerman bien. Espero que llueva ahora, you know, y puedan dormir súper, súper tranquilos. See you tomorrow. Have a wonderful rest of your day. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, good night. See you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye, bye. Peter. Ay, hello, Mabel. Yo la escuché que iba a compartir una lista de verbos que creo que a los que ya trae hace meses ya se las había compartido, pero no la he visto. Yo no, no me la podría compartir. Aquí la tengo y se me olvidó compartírsela. I have it like, ready. Well, tengo algunos acá. I have some here. Eh, uh -huh. Porque les iba a compartir la pantallita, you know. So, uh -huh. acá, pero solo son algunos. La otra lista eh, sí se la voy a compartir como un documento PDF. Para que comencemos, porque uh -huh. acá seleccioné como algunos, eh, le puede tomar captura. You can like take a picture of this. Uh -huh. eh, y ahorita mismo le comparto la otra, se la voy a compartir en discusión. Eh, le va a aparecer como lista de verbos para que la descargue. Y uh -huh. creo que es, es mejor imprimirla algunas veces, right? So it uh -huh. is better, y así ya la tiene como bien a la mano. Ahorita se la comparto. Okay. Thank you. Teacher. Gracias por recordarme, Mish. <laughs> Thank you so okay, much for that reminder. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Bye, Guadalupe. See you tomorrow.